Mental Health Queen, thanks so much for stopping on this video. My name is Allison and I'm the founder of DeFore Institute. Today I'm going to be telling you five tips on how you can start drinking more water in order to support your leaky gut. But first let me go ahead and tell you why water is so important to healing the gut. I feel like it's so overlooked so I really want to dive into this. So when I was healing my gut, I before I healed my gut, I had so many issues, you know, gut issues. <laughs> I had skin issues, I had dry skin, rosacea, I had leaky gut, I had constipation, I had brain fog, I had like all these things. And all these symptoms that I had started going away when I started drinking more water. So that is why I'm so passionate about this. And the reason that water consumption is so important to healing the gut is because the water literally helps us detoxify our colon in a natural and gentle way. This is how our body is supposed to detoxify. You know, we don't, our body doesn't need to use all these like chemicals and other you know, things. Of course, we can use other plants in order to aid in our detoxification, but water is the natural way that our body was made to detoxify. And of course, water helps to hydrate our entire body, which just helps inflammation and helps the healing process even more. So now let me get right into those five tips on how you can start drinking more water. So my first tip is going to be getting a reusable water bottle that is a large bottle. And what I mean by that is one that holds at least 32 ounces of water, like this one that I got from Amazon, and one that also has a built-in straw or an area where you can insert your own reusable straw. And the reason for this is because I just want it to be as easy as possible for you to drink large amounts of water and not have to refill your water bottle a bunch of times. Another thing is the reason I want you to have a straw is because it just helps you gulp down the water faster, helps you get more in your body and you don't have to try and balance the water bottle on your hand and trying to drink from a huge open container. So I think having a straw makes it so much easier. So now let's go into tip number two, which is going to be adding flavorings to your water, natural flavors. So I'm talking about now adding sliced fruit, adding veggies, adding herbs, and even adding natural essential oil based flavorings. So the first one is adding fruits, veggies, herbs. These can be things like strawberries, other berries, cucumbers, oranges, and herbs like even like rosemary and mint and basil. And these can all just add that little bit of flavor that makes it just taste so much better, so much just like, it doesn't taste like tasteless water anymore. It actually has the essence of some of these veggies or fruits that you're adding and it just tastes so amazing. And another thing that you can do is find these natural food grade essential oil based water flavorings that you can add to your bottle of water and it just gives it a natural fruit taste or you can mix them and make your own flavors. So this one is lime and I love lime. So you can like mix this with some lemon flavoring or even lemon juice in your water and it can make like a nice you know, lemon lime flavor. And then this one is also, this one is watermelon. And I really love this one. It tastes like a watermelon sucker, literally, like one of those dum-dums. And they're just, they're both so great. So I love adding, I love adding natural flavorings like that to water when I don't have the actual fruit to add. Another thing that you can do is add it to sparkling water, which brings me to my next tip, which is tip number three, trying sparkling water for variety. So make sure that if you, you know, this is especially for people who like sodas. If you like the feeling of the carbonation and you're really craving that carbonation, I would suggest either getting your own natural spring, spring sparkling water 
Or you could also get what's called a soda stream, which I have at home. You can get them from Target for like 45, 50 bucks, something like that. And you can make your own sparkling water at home, which I think is so cool. So I have one of those and we, me and my fiance, love to make sparkling water and add some of those natural flavorings, the natural oil-based flavorings that this give it such a great taste and they have no sweetener in them but they taste so sweet like they're so good especially the watermelon one so i have some of this have some of that in here right now and it just helps you drink more water and gives it a different taste which is so awesome so tip number four is going to be making sure that you are drinking high quality natural spring water or another type of purified water. So the reason I say natural spring water is just because it has beneficial minerals and micronutrients that the body needs. And then you could also have purified waters such as reverse osmosis, alkaline water, and water that comes from a Kangen machine that filters the tap water. So this brings me to tip number five, which is 10 gulps of water Per drink. So whenever you feel like you want a drink of water, take 10 gulps. And this is where the straw is going to make it very, very easy for you to do this. <laughs> so when you, whenever you feel thirsty, whenever you feel like you have the inclination to grab your bottle bottle, open it, take 10 gulps. Most people just take like one or two sips and they're good, but you're not going to be able to, you're not going to be able to finish half a gallon to a full gallon of water every day if you are taking just two sips of water every time you're taking a drink. So you need to purposely drink more. And the way you can do that is just every time taking 10 gulps. And you can just do this, you know, you can just count on your head, count with your fingers, whatever you wanna do. And you could take a break in between if you feel like you're like losing breath or whatever, you know, do it safely for you. <laughs> So those are the five tips for drinking more water in order to support your leaky gut. Again, number one was getting a large water bottle that has its own straw. Number two was adding your own fruits and natural flavorings in order to give it a, a different taste. Number three was to try sparkling water to add a variety to your palate. Number four was to drink natural spring water or a purified water that comes from reverse osmosis, alkaline, or a Kangen water machine. And number five was to take 10 gulps of water every time you want to take a drink. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Again, my name is Allison DeFore. I'm the founder of DeFore Institute. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure that you go to the description, click the link to watch my free gut health workshop on how you can start producing more collagen in your, in your body in order to heal your leaky gut. And it's 100% plant-based vegan. So I hope you have a wonderful day and talk to you later, queens. Bye. Oh, and make sure that if you liked this video, you give it a thumbs up and you hit subscribe so you'll see more of my videos in the weeks to come. Bye, queens.